start good morning children hope you are all doing good okay this is the new version of a kaka party kada you know old grandma used to sit under the tree and sell vadas and you know their crow will come and pick that vada and it will sit on the top of the tree and then who will come nandita who will come and ask the fox the fox will come and cunning fox will ask hey, you are looking so beautiful why don't you sing a song to me and then this foolish crow will what what it will do it will open its mouth and say ka 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 and then what will happen the vada from the mouth will fall and then the clever fox will pick it up and run away the crow will start cry this is the old story okay where your mother your grandmother your grand grandmother and all used to tell the same story but today's story is different okay the new same version. yeah new version same crow is there fox is there okay but this is sir uh, the grandmother is a new grandmother okay so now we'll start with the new version of our grandma's okay vada story okay now there was a village small village okay it is called puvarasampatti okay and uh, the people in that village they used to work very hard okay all of them they go you know the uh, village people they work in a field okay they grow vegetables and then grains okay they are farmers and some of them they go every day to their if they own a, a farm they go and work in their farm if they don't own and the other people will come for every day daily wages they work from morning 6 o'clock till evening 6 o'clock they are hard workers before sunrise itself they will go take all that uh, things okay and then they go to the field and work very hard they don't like to sit idle at home okay they are all hard workers and they like to work also so in this village puvar sampatti also people are hard workers all men will get up early and then they will dress up and go to their fields and work now what like that they were all going now in that village there was a big banyan tree okay banyan tree banyan tree alamaram you know it's a big tree alamaram i will show okay uh then that in that tree under that tree it has lot of branches okay this uh, banyan tree it lives for a long long years and when the when one uh, branches if it falls and then if it falls on the ground again a new root it will pick up the root from the ground and then again it will grow so it keeps growing okay that is banyan tree so it was a very so in those days and all they'll have a stove with they put all the sticks and they would burn it you no know? so like that she had a small stove and then morning she will prepare idlis hot hot idlis chatti sambar and all she'll make in the morning and in the evenings you know she likes snacks you know what she prepares vada bajji all that she prepares because no evening only the children will all come from the school no so they would like to eat her but as she makes 
delicious vada like your mama's vadas no she also prepares beautiful vadas and then and then she used to sell it in the evening morning breakfast all this men will go to their fields no so before going they eat the hot idlis and they go to their work evening when it comes they will come for the hot hot vadas so like this she was selling every day and this old lady no grandma she is very clean okay every day she gets up nicely she will have a bath she will come to her that place okay under the tree she will clean all the place with the broom stick she will remove all the sticks okay all the leaves she will keep it very clean okay and then uh, she will uh, she will get two pots every day she will get two pots do you know in that pot one pot she will keep water to wash the hands in another pot she will have water to drink after eating you may need water to drink no so she will keep all her things very neat and clean even her uh, whatever tiffin she makes no she will bring few baskets with lids so that no she will have bring all those vessels with a got lid so she will keep prepare and put it inside that so that it is not kept open no you must have seen no road uh, side street shops and all they sell it all open no we never buy those things no do you buy all things they sell on the road when they keep it open and all no no flies will be there street dust will be there so mamma will never get things no from the street but this party no she always keeps all whatever she has prepared no she'll keep it in a small container the closed container she will keep it so even big men old big old ladies old men and even the small children will also buy from her and she always insists them whenever you buy whenever they come to buy no she'll say go 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 wash your hands and then come so they all listen to her you know in the meantime no when they she comes and plays sometimes with them she talks to the children okay and uh, some of no in those days and all uh, when you buy vada uh, bachi and all how do they give it now they are giving it in a plate they serve it in a plate those days and all those days and all usually uh, they will keep it in a, a leaf and under that there will be yes uh, they'll keep it in uh, banana box banana, banana leaf. leaf yeah in yes. that like that also they usually keep it in a leaf and then they uh, to wrap it around they'll use a newspaper or some uh, other papers okay used book paper and all she had so in that used papers no lot of small small story will be written in that no when you went first standard second standard and a lot of stories are written in your books no so in that also she when she gets that paper or that old paper she used to read that stories to the small children so the children like to sit with her okay they buy vada and they eat and they listen to her stories also every day lot of children will come and if they don't have money she will say no 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 problem you give me tomorrow okay so she will help the children also to get the vadas and all so like this she was selling every day and she was so happy very cheerful okay every day one day who came there came a crow this crow was slowly he came and then came near the party and was looking at the vadas it so it you showing that crow picture yes this is a crow can you see yes okay so the crow came and then sat near the party and was looking at the vadas mm nice smell i am getting mm, mm. i feel i am feeling hungry i 
this crow did not ask vada from the party and it was looking only at the vada what party was preparing lot of hot 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 delicious vada she made and then she put it in the basket i told no she had a basket and she will put all the vada she will close it and keep it and this crow was watching 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 mm nice smell i am feeling hungry no and then no but the crow is very good no he is a very good boy he said i will not ask anything i will wait 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 he was waiting now the party looked at the crow oh are you hungry now the crow said yes 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 i am hungry would you like to have a vada and then the party gave the vada she just offered the vada but what did the crow say no 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 i don't want i don't want the vada why the party asked you know my mother told not to take anything from others okay for free she always tell to do some work okay never get it for free so i don't want any vada the party was so surprised what is this this crow is not taking vada from me in that old story what will the crow do it will never ask it will have just picked up the vada and it would have flown away but this crow is not taking my vada when i offer it also oh i am so astonished what is this ah, what should i do now so the crow said party 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 you please give me some work okay so if you give me some small work let me go and finish that work once i finish your work then you can give me your vadas that time i can take your vadas but not now so give me some work to do so what he also thought okay what work shall i give this crow this little crow what shall i give so the party was thinking thinking that ki ah i got okay she had a stove no i told no they usually put all the sticks and then they burn it no those days and all like that she had the stove so she said party said to the crow 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 can you just help me can you collect few dry sticks for me so that i can use it as a fire to burn okay for it to burn and to cook my snacks so can you go fly and collect some dry sticks for me so the crow was also very happy oh okay 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 this i can do with my beak i can collect all the dry sticks so the crow was very happy okay so it started flying it started flying 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 <coughs> sorry it flew to a long distance very unlucky that day she he was very unlucky that day he could not find dry sticks that day was searching here here there no no sticks were there ayyo what shall i do i am hungry also that vada was also coming into the crow's mind ayyo what will i do i am tired i am tired he went and sat on a top of a tree he was sitting on a branch he was so tired he was very sad today i can't find any sticks dry sticks now i won't get my vada also what shall i do you sad tree there was a monkey playing in that tree this monkey saw the crow hey why are you sad what happened to you the crow said <laughs> then he told everything about the vada 
and the work the party gave everything into. Hey, turn to worry. Why are you worrying for this small thing? Okay, let me help you, the monkey said. You sit here, you sit here, relax, 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 okay? Just give me five minutes. I can collect all the dry sticks for you and dry leaves also I'll get it for you. Don't worry. The monkey told and then he said, you sit here only, don't go anywhere. Then the jumpy started jumping from one tree to other. And then to the next tree when he jumped, he sat on that branch and what did he do? He started shaking and tapping. Started shaking, shaking and then breaking with that hands and the tail. It started breaking the branches. It was making a loud noise with that. And then what happened? The dry leaves, the dry, the, the, the dry sticks that was already dried in that tree started falling from the tree. Wow, nice idea, no? The monkey. So the monkey went down, collected all those dry sticks and leaves and then came and gave it to the crow. The crow was so happy. He said, thank you so much. But the monkey said, I did. I helped you, no? What will you give for me? Ah, the crow said, like this. My party said she will give me two vadas. I will give one vada to you. Okay. So the monkey was very happy. He said, he said, okay, take the sticks and you go to the party. So what did the crow do? He took all the collected few, few sticks, kept it in the bee and then went and dropped in the party's place. He picked up few leaves in the, from the bee and then it will fly and then it will go and drop it in the other stalk. So, like that, he, the crow, collected all the sticks and then gave it to the party. Now, the party also, by this time, she has made all vadas. And she was very happy. And he said, oh, you are very, very good. And then, how many vadas she gave? She gave two vadas. So, one, the crow ate off. The remaining one she has to, he has to give it to the monkey, no? So he kept that vada in the hand. It was, he sat on the tree and was the first vada he was trying to eat. By the time who came? Fox. 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 Yes. The fox came slowly. And then, yes, the fox came slowly. And looked up the crow. And the fox was looking at the crow. And then he was just looking. And then, but this fox also, no. He did not ask the crow to sing a song and all. He was waiting, waiting and looking at the crow eating the vada. Now the crow, now it became very clever. He said, I will not be foolish enough to sing a song. If I sing, if I open my mouth, my vada will fall. No. Ah, I am now intelligent. I won't sing. I won't even open my mouth. Okay. And started eating. And then uh, after way, uh, he, he took the vada and kept it under the uh, foot and then under the leg. And then the crow asked, what do you want? Foxy, why are you standing and looking at me? What do you want? The fox said, Crow, I want water. Want water? Okay. But I can't give you. I, I got it. I worked and then I got it. I can't give you. I am not foolish enough. I can't sing a song also now. I am very clever. I become very clever. Now the fox said, yes, yes, yes. Even now I have become a good fox. Nowadays I don't cheat other people. Even my parents, my mother and father, they have told me not to grab things from the other people. Not to cheat and take from other people. 
so nowadays i have become very good okay i am listening to my parents so i don't want free vada and all free vada then crow asked then what do you want what uh, the fox said you give me some work let me go and do some work then you can give me anything but the but the crow had only two vadas so the crow doesn't want to share the vadas because the crow has to give one vada to the monkey also so the crow said foxy you go to the party okay there is a party sitting under that banyan tree no you go and ask her she will give some work and you she might give you also something to eat the vada also so you go and ask so the fox said okay thank you thank you and then the fox went to the parties and the party was sitting and then what was she preparing vada yeah. yes that vada she was preparing now the fox came very close to her then looked at the vada but he's become a good boy no he did not take anything he said party 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 even i have become a good animal okay i don't want to grab from you even i i told my friend crow also that i will not grab the vada from her also so please give me some work for me and i can do that work okay and then you can give me vada after i finish my work i will be happy and you will also be happy so the party was so surprised what is this oh you have also come to eat my vada but you don't want to take it for free you want some work you want to do some work for me very good very good let me think at that time in that pot there was no water the all the water will became they have used the water so one pot was empty so the party told foxy foxy why don't you get water for me from the well okay take this bucket so the foxy said okay i can do this work so she took the bucket in the mouth and then he started running to the well there was a big well after reaching the well how to draw water the water will be inside the well no you can't just put your bucket and you can't take water no from the well so you need a what a rope a rope to tie the bucket then you can put that bucket in said then you can draw water so there was no rope aye yo i don't have a rope to tie to the bucket and draw water now what to do it was looking then the fox went to the nearby house and knocked at the door and there came a small girl like shri vidya kept running okay he came out and saw the fox <laughs> what is this fox he has come to my house what do you want to just slowly open he didn't she didn't open fully okay she just open little and then she open little and looked and looked at the foxy and said what do you want what do you want no mummy is not here i can't come out don't come inside i'm scared of you then the fox said don't get scared don't get scared okay i have just come i cannot ask. see the girl yeah still cannot see still yeah now now okay okay so oh, look like a girl look like a yeah. boy it is a girl okay now the uh girl said don't come inside i am very scared please please mummy is not here don't come i am scared of you but the fox is said no 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 don't worry don't worry i will not harm you okay i just need a small help from you can you just give me a rope can i borrow a 
withdraw from you because I have to take water. Okay. I don't have the room. So I will return it to you. And even when I return it, if you help me, when I return, whatever the party told me, she will give me, I can share that vadas to you also. So the girl said, oh, you are such a good foxy. Okay, I am ready to help you. Okay, but do, I don't want vada and all. Okay, I don't like vada. I don't want vada. I, I am ready to help you. But what you should do, return my rope. Because my mommy will come and ask, where is the rope? And she will get angry and she will beat me. So I will give you, but you should return the rope to me. So the foxy said, sure, 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 sure. I will not cheat you. I am a good foxy, okay? And then the girl went inside and brought the rope. Now the fox took the rope and then tied it to the bucket. And then he drew water from the well. And then he went and gave it to the party. And the party, she collected all the water in the pot. And then you know how many vadas this time she gave? Can you guess? It's four, five vadas of what? He, he was so happy, the foxy. Foxy said, oh, started eating two vadas. But he remembered to return the rope to the girl. So he took the remaining three vadas. He went and gave the rope and also one vada to her. And the remaining two vadas, he had a brother and a sister. So he took it home and he shared with her brother and the sister. So that day, they all ate the vadas. And they were so happy. Okay. That is the end of this story. Say bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. That was so long story. The almost more than 30 minutes. Yes. This like year I'm going to Thailand. Okay. Tell me about the story. Did you like the old story or this new story? New. I don't know both. I you. told you. New story I like. Story. I love both. You love both. Okay. Nandita? This new Kaka story you liked? Hmm. Where is Srinidhi? Come, come in the video. Kavya? Have you heard this story? I think it is a very old story, but yes, thank you, Kavya, for coming to the story session. Mm. Dashna. Vishab, put the kada. Kaka kada. Enga Sudiksha enga. Sudiksha class ko paita. Class ko paita la. Okay, okay. Apra, you will tell the story to Akka. Sorry, yes. Chalri, yeah. Mm. Good, 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 good. Yes. Yes, we hurry. Shall we want to stop the recording or they can talk? Talk. talk. Okay, talk. Sri Vidya, uh, talk. So, Risha Darshan want to tell a story? Yaro uh -huh. Sutrinangle. Somebody told Kuti Papa. Solitary, you are not preparing. Hmm. Next Cannot, week, I please. don't have time. I oh, to my company. God. You don't have time. What are you doing at home 24 hours? 24 hours. I'm Nobody going told they will tell us. 4 o'clock. Okay. 4 o'clock or 6 30. I'm going home. Risha, Risha. TV and study. Yeah, watching TV is not a good time spending. And the time like you can sit and prepare, no? Rishav, yeah, I every day like hmm. watch TV. But that, that is why you are wasting time. Hmm. Rishav, are you ready to tell a story? Yes. Yeah. 
Yes. Okay. Oh, so okay. Uh, last week he wanted to tell a story. I'll put you in spotlight. So, Rishav, in which class are you studying? First standard. Ah, super. Apriya, work out of face. Okay. Ready. Start. One minute. Okay, one minute. take one and a half minute. <laughs> <laughs> So cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, till Rishav comes. Okay, we will talk about the story. Srividya, mm. how was your Taipusam festival? Srividya, did you enjoy Taipusam festival? Yes. What did you pray to Lord Murga? I will tell the story. Oh, you are ready to tell? One second, Risha. Welcome. Shri Vidya, how was your uh, Taipusam celebrations? Shri Hari and Shri Vidya. Shri Niti, Kavya, all of you celebrate. Why did you celebrate uh, Taipusam? What is Taipusam? Any idea? Everyone is going to go to the house, 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 go to the house. You all celebrated, no? You know why are we celebrating Thai Pusam? Why are we celebrating Thai Pusam? For farmers? Mm -hmm. For? Yeah. For food? Food is a day. It's a good day. It's a good day. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Shri Hari, Shri Vidya, Shri Niti, Kavya. We'll find out next week why are we celebrating Thai Pusam? What is the... I want to celebrate it. Yeah, you want to celebrate it. Shri Hari wants to celebrate Thai Pusam is what again? What again? Other than again. Pongalan. He's asking Pongalan. Parwal, at least he remembers Pongal. Wait a second. Risha, wait. Wait. Shri Hari, you want to say about Thai Pusa? The school of uh, uh, lion dance patto. Ah, all paarenge. Thai Pusa tikpay nalla mukkenge. Ana yenna seeduk celebrate pandran marmarenge. Teri la kandu pudi kile. Uttna na mukle. Solu Shri Hari. Unmute pani te solu. Shri Hari. Tell me. <laughs> Everybody, everybody keep quiet. Shri Hari will talk. Pace connect. Thai Masa Okay, you will share in the group. Okay, Sri Vidya wants to say something. Yeah, or she's clapping. Mm. Cherry. Now we will go to Rishav Darshan story. I am going to spotlight Rishav Darshan. We will hear the story. Tamil liya, English liya kanne? Tamil liya, English ha? English. English. Pa. Super. So lenga. Start. Mm -hmm. Ma'am, actually he is trying to read and this. Parvala, no problem. Parvala. No problem. That's okay. Parvala. Let him. That's okay. It's okay. Here get him. The boy who cried wolf. There was one a boy who looked after, after the sheep in the village. The boy was often <laughs> called... One second, one second. Please, everybody else, uh, mute yourself. Thank you. Uh, Rishav, continue. This step took play a trick on the villagers. To Amar amuse his tail, pull, pull. He mm. cried at the, at the top of his voice. Oh. The villagers came rushing up 
the ship up the hill to save the ship. Hmm. But when they got there, there was no wood hmm. to be seen, and the boy laughed at them. Hmm. You must not tell lies. Oh, then right. the villagers and the angry angry hmm. they went back down to the village hmm. soon the boy was more again so he shouted for for hmm. again hmm. the villagers pushed rush up the hill to save the ship the boy laughed you must not tell lies, said the villagers angrily. Mm. Then they went back to the village. Mm -hmm. Later, later that day, while, while the boy was watching the sheep, mm. a wolf really did come. Oh. Into the feet. Oh. The boy cried and cried, poor, poor, no one come to help. And the wolf ate all the sheep. More love the no one will believe a lay liar even when he is telling. ஆல்சோ Very okay. beautiful. Super, super. Amazing. Amazing. Vian, Vian yeah. the story Very is about a boy who will look after the sheep. Okay. He will take all the sheep for grazing. Oh, I read that. Ah, yeah. Now you remember. Simply he will shout wolf, wolf, wolf. And then no, oh, he will just simply make fun. Okay. All the villagers will come and they go, will. Go down the hill then and make. Uh, they like, really will think the over the say that no no i simply told you and then the villagers will get angry and they will go away really one day the big wolf will come when yeah. that time when he shouts no one will come okay and the wolf will eat all the goat all the sheep and then he will run away so that is the story என்ன கதை சொல்லுங்க என்ன சொல்லி கத்துவான் புலி வருது புலி வருதுன்னு கத்துவான் தமிழ்ல இந்த கதையை நீங்க தமிழ்ல சொல்லும் பொழுது இங்கிலீஷ்ல சொல்லும் போது உல்ஃப் உல்ஃப் தமிழ்ல சொல்லும் பொழுது வி யூஸ் டு சே அந்த குட்டி பையன் புலி வருது புலி வருதுன்னு கத்துனா சோ டூ த்ரீ டைம்ஸ் ஸ்டோரி <laughs> Okay. Yes, 